Hi, in this video of C programming language, we will discuss about escape sequences. Basically, while discussing the string constants, we have gone through an overview of this escape sequence, but here we will have a deeper look on them. As here, you can see a list of all the escape sequences which always starts with a backslash and here they have the different meaning. Like for example, if I want to print a backslash, I will use double slashes. Similarly, to print a single quote or double quote, I will simply put a backslash symbol before them. Slash A will be a beep symbol. If you want to give an alert message, you can use a slash A before that. Similarly, backspace for slash B, form feed for slash B, new line. If you want to make a new line, if you want to break a line while printing anything, you can use slash N, slash R for carriage return, slash T for tab space and slash V for a vertical tab, right? If you want to give a gap vertically. And if you want to put the, uh, if you want to print any octal value, then you can go for the slash OOO, octal number of one, two, three digits. So here we also have an example where we have used so many escape sequences, but rather than discussing this program here, let's go to system and try it practically. So for the escape sequences, here you can see I have used a lot of backslashes. So let's start with this one. Like for printing this double quotes inside printf or inside any other method which prints a string, you can just put a slash and then double quote. It will enable you to print the double quote symbol. Similarly, I wanted to enclose this A character inside the double quotes. So at both the ends, I have put slash double quotes and then slash double quotes, which will print this A inside these double quotations. Right after that, I have used slash T, which will give a tab space. Then B character will be there. Then after that, I have used slash N, which will break the line. Similarly, here also you can see C and then slash and D. So C and D will be printed in a different lines. Now here you can see I have used backslash that is slash B. So first you will write A then it will do a backslash backspace sorry but not a backslash but backspace. So as soon as you will write A and then backspace so what it will do it will delete that character A and then after that I will write a space and B. So when I will execute, you can see like there is no A in the last one, but one space and B is there. If I will remove this backslash B means I, if I will remove this uh, backspace, then I will see A and B. But to remove this backspace, you can use this slash B. Similarly, we do have some more escape sequences like if I want to print the question mark I can do it directly as well but using slash also next is let's line break after that if I want to print the single quotes again I can put it like this and similarly if I want to print the slash itself I can print a double slash so it will enable us to print a single slash so like here you can see question mark then single quotes and then a slash. So this is how you can simply use this backslash as a escape sequence and then after you can put any appropriate character for a meaningful sequence.